Hey dreamers, welcome back to my channel, Dreamlight Valley Decor. Please make sure to thumbs up this video and subscribe. I'm very excited for this video and we are going to be showing the full Dazzle Beach today, um, the full build. So I'm very excited for that. This has took me a very long time um, to finally just sit down and try to get it done because I've never fully finished my beach until now. So as you can see, the entrance to the Forest of Valor is right there. And um, I put little restrooms right there. They, I think they look super cute next to the house. Um, and on the beach, it's like a perfect place to have them um, with the setup that I created. So as you can see, I put a little path to behind a little, a little um, dirt path. And then this is the beach house. I think it looks really great uh, on the beach with the little canoe club sign. I think that looks so cute. I love that sign. I think it's super cute. And then I created a path here and it really like gives the vibe. This whole area is giving like a resort kind of like a resort on the beach vibe to me i created like a little bar which is super cute i really like that and you can sit in your and your friends can sit too but i don't think i think it's like these this new set if you you know those chairs i don't think with the table i don't think that the anybody can sit on those if like since they're like too close to the table i love how close they are to the table because i hate them being further out because it looks terrible but and of course as i'm doing the tour i forgot to clean up my beach so i'm going to be doing you know trying to multitask here trying not to make, I don't want it to look too bad while I'm showing you guys my beach, you know what I mean? <laughs> so, I'm trying to clean up for my guests on YouTube. <laughs> so, I, and I just don't have time to do it for everything, so I'm just going to leave those there. So, that is that side of the beach. Uh, and then you'll see, like, I have, like, a little... I love how the posts look there. I think that actually looks really good. Um, I was better than I expected it to because I was going to use the same fencing that I used in the that area the, over there. Um, this one, yeah. I was going to use that fence, but I was like, no, let me use this white one and see how that looks. And I like that actually so much better. I don't know why. I don't know what it is, but I think that it looks good. And then you see it. Like, I didn't do too much to Moana's house because there's just not a lot of space and I didn't want it be, to be too cluttered. Uh, I probably could add some tiki lights there to make it stand out at night more. So I might do that, but. So for Skull, in front of Skull Island, um, I didn't know what to do here. And I seen so many people have put their shipwreck here. So I was like, why not, let's do that. And so I made it like a little like shipwreck area and pirate area. And I put the treasure, I put the shipwreck, I put this, um, the scrolls and Maui statue, all that stuff in like a lot of grass, like made it look like overgrown was the goal. And uh, like an untouched area, ideally. And I just, that's all I could think of doing. Like the island is so small and I needed somewhere to put my well and it didn't fit in anywhere that I decorated on the other side of the beach. So I was like, I have to figure out where to put this. And that was the only space. So it just all worked out you know the best that I could in that spot and so I love putting like as many shifts as possible here I think it looks really good kind of like a little docking station and then like as you guys saw earlier this is like the little path to the, the cave that's there and then I set up the little, like little tents I thought that would be so cute there on the little tents um and then I used the actually the um I used the Christmas rugs underneath the tents and then these are like little stalls that I have and I put Moana's boat and of course I love I love the boat at the end of the dock I just do it just looks it just looks good so I just continue to leave that there it's always been there and I just have left it there even now and so um again these are like just little stalls with different things I thought that this would look so cute there <laughs> underneath the stall the little sitting area from lawn set, set up and then um 
this is a little as you can see I'm still trying to clean up guys like I'm sorry I'm sorry my place is such a mess but <laughs> um, there's like a little workstation area with the benches and the desk like the workbench in which I actually like the workbench there because then when I'm doing stuff or trying to build stuff on the beach I didn't have to, when I was building I didn't have to go all the way home to do that which was fantastic actually so that's what that end of the beach looks like and so this is the other end of the beach I honestly really don't know what to do boardwalk wise this was like all I could really come up with at the moment um, I think it looks pretty cute I actually like it very much um, I like that it's unique I haven't seen anyone use that path or use that kind of fence on the beach I got a little sitting cute little private sitting area on the beach I thought that was cute with little trash cans but you can't get to the to the mining the rock that's behind it so I might have to change something about that because I need to be able to get to that rock but anyways um this is you know the little area that I built I mean like little um I used the tiki uh, umbrellas uh, to cover the little areas of the beach for people that um imaginary people <laughs> that lay on the beach I don't, anyways um and so yeah so i think it came out pretty good i actually really liked it this house is so cute i think it's super cute i think it's one of the i love that house like so much i think it came out really it was so worth the bundle um i wish i could have decorated it more but there's not a lot of space here on the beach on that area so it's kind of hard i pushed ariel out further because i didn't know what the heck to do with her um in the area i tore down the area that i had originally built for her a long time ago like over a year ago and then i put a little cute sitting area here it's so cute with the little um what are they called again i can't think my mind blinked but yeah they're so cute it's such a cute little area but the little truck and so that is my beach you guys i hope you like it i'm gonna show actually how it looks at night too um, but i'm not gonna keep talking because i just don't know what else to say so <laughs> So I'm going to go ahead and put music on for the rest of this and I hope you guys enjoy the nighttime tour of the beach and I will be back towards the end.
all right guys isn't it so pretty at night i love the beach at night i think it's so relaxing but i really hope you guys enjoyed the tour thank you guys so much for all the love all the support as always i seriously appreciate it more than you know and thank you guys for a thousand subscribers wow never did i ever think it would get that far but thank you guys so much let me know what was your favorite part of the beach love you guys